In the 1910s, physicists started looking at the emission spectra of atoms to confirm a model by Niels Bohr, where a dense atomic nucleus is surrounded by electrons whose orbits can only have certain energy values. But there was a problem. Peter Seemann observed that when putting these atoms in a magnetic field, emission lines that should have the same energy, in fact, do not, and split up. This prompted another famous physicist, Wolfgang Pauli, to introduce a new degree of freedom associated with the electron in the outermost shell of the atom that he called a two-valuedness not describable classically. Today, we know this as spin. It is a quantum property of the electron. At first, physicists were unsure on how to interpret this new degree of freedom physically, but since then, there's been a lot of experiments that confirm this existence. Of course, it actually has nothing to do with the particle spinning, but that might be a topic for another video.